Asada is proud to present the new piezo-powered ultrasonic inactive eyes and tips. We took the unit you're already familiar with and added a series of six different piezo-powered tips that will revolutionize surgery, giving you greater ease of use, greater cutting efficiency and reduced trauma for the patient. Let's take a tour of the new INAC and its innovative INAC tips. The INAC, thanks uh, to, the, to its uh, innovative special tips, enables you to perform complex minimally invasive surgery on your patients. Its high performance is uh, achieved through the use of a special vibration uh, frequency that uh, is uh, easily adjustable to both soft and uh, hard tissue using minimally discomfort to the patient. This is how traditional surgery evolves into microsurgery. The new INAC-10 facilitates extraction, osteotomy, apisectomy and insertion of implants, periodontal surgery, sinus lifting and much more. The first two are the sword type tips. One is type L, the other type S. Both are designed for cutting into soft tissue, separating soft tissue from hard tissue, separating cartilage tissue from the hard tissue or bone and separation of tendon and muscle from bone. These two tips replace the scalpel. The great benefit of uh, these two tips is that they offer a wide range of uh, cutting angles including easy access and higher uh, efficiency in the operation. The superior cutting power of INAX tips enable you to achieve the same flexibility and accuracy as a laser cutter with one significant advantage. Only INAC allows you full control of cutting depth. And for the patient, INAC means minimally invasive treatment, reduced trauma and significantly less bleeding. In the unlikely event of slippage, tips will not wound the tongue, unlike a scalpel or other traditional device. The hoe type tip is designed for the separation of soft tissue during flap opening as in cases involving the removal of sinus mucose, root extraction, collecting shattered bone during root extraction, and the extraction of cysts. So, as you have probably realized by now, the single most immediate benefit of the tip is its multi-usage. However, even more than its flexibility, there is one procedure where the hoe-type tip is unbeatable by any other device on the market. The accurate removal of shattered bone. Until now, you probably had to fill the bone defect by transferring bone fragments or blocks in a patient's mouth. Not anymore. The whole type tip can gently scale healthy cortical bone, collect it and they use it in situ to fill any defect. Next up is the trumpet tip. The trumpet tip enhances a number of procedures. Mucose separation, bone and tissue separation and bone compression. This tip replaces the manual unit that requires some pressure on the mouth. Last, but by no means least, are the spoons. One for the right and a second for the left, thereby facilitating easy separation during treatment. In some cases, the spoons can also contribute to soft tissue separation. The unit frequency enables use of tips with minimum manual pressure and the final result is less pressure, reduced swelling, reduced edema and less bleeding. Now let's take a quick look at the tips in action. Cyst removal. Here you can see the use of three tips and how fine and gentle their performance is. The L-type sword tip greatly enhances the separation of soft tissue. The hoe type tip enables further flap opening and helps to delineate the window size prior to cyst removal. Extraction on tooth D47. In the extraction of tooth D47, the hoe tip greatly facilitates the separation of a split tooth from the alveolus. Notice how the hoe tip spares the bone and how no pressure is required. Bleeding is also significantly reduced as the hoe tip creates through its frequency an antispastic effect on the alveolus. Implants. 
Here we can see a case of an implant insertion in type 2 bone. The surgeon uses an L-type sword tip in order to open the tissue, perform a flap lift and make space in the bone in order to insert the implant. With the L-type sword tip, everything is achieved in one easy action. Think of the time and effort this saves. Case number one. Here you can see how the L-type sword tip delimits the window, cuts the bone and lifts the bone block. Look at the cutting angle. Now, looking at the larger L-type, the surgeon removes an extremely thin layer of the bone without tearing or cutting into the mucose. Following this, the surgeon performs a primary separation of the membrane using the trumpet tip. Case number two. In this case, an operation is being performed on a thick bone. Notice how smooth it becomes. Case number three. Here you can see a gentle lifting of the bone. Notice how the unit cuts the bone and gently penetrates the mucose. The new Inac tips, putting the patient first. Less bleeding, less tissue trauma, less force applied toward the patient. Less post-operative complications, faster recovery. Osada's Inac piezo-powered ultrasonic scalpels. The new approach to oral surgery.